Ray Winfro. This is, this is Red Deer Classics. This is my introduction to how I feel tiny space ought to be in the enjoyment of space. So this is my unit here. This is our front wall here, your couch. You see the details. So this room here was called the room of hearts, meaning I have three different in the wood categories. This is purple heart. This is yellow heart, and this is orange heart. Three is an important number in life and everything that we do. So if you'll come around here, this is actually the start of the living room, but there was a fellow by the name of Frank Lloyd Wright who had a principle called compress and release. So now you can see the compression of this room. So when you open the door, it simply allows you to feel good and then you're able to look through you feel you feel the room that that to me is important in when we need to dwell and be able to be a good person so this is this got many you know antler handles some of these are moves there again here's all your heartwood your different deals i mean things to enhance the opening of things we don't ever uh Exercise, I think, what we could all really do. So let's start doing that. You can see the different countertops, the different, these are all, you know, all pitch pieces that I've cut. We've got some turquoise in them, the different antlers, self-closing drawers once they go in. They, they you know, things that to me don't need to be lost. And we have storage in here, different, there again, walnut cabinets a nice orange heart cabinet and stuff. So this room feels good. So then you come into the bathroom and within that we've done some barn wood, you know, some doors too, to not take up space. Here's your toilet area. This wall is called birds in flight. The wall that you see here, you know, I like to, you know, I want you to think and be happy. Then you come into your bathroom over here into your shower, but yet at the same time, let's close this other door. So you can really get a feel of this room, kind of the enjoyment of this room. Same thing in the countertops, you know, real turquoise powder, just something that's, you know, something that's different, something that's organic that's reused. Same way I know some would think that we killed a bunch of deer, but really they, they throw their antlers off. So if you're able to find them, it's a really green, good product to use. The shower was made to give you space, okay? In tiny, you can't change the way that you bathe and clean yourself, and you can't change the way that you sleep, even though you think you can. So, you know, if you're thinking about going into that movement, experience those things for a while wherever you're at, because as we all know, sometimes when we think we're right, we can be wrong. Don't make that mistake. Just think through the process of going tiny, really. Live it for a little bit because what you think you might have been able to do, you can't do. And we don't want in this industry that same principle of the happiest time of the boat guy was buying and selling. No, we want fulfillment. We want usage. So here's the master. There's the door there of going out because in the bathroom, what I've done is plain. My principles are in the dark and the light in the bathroom, okay? And that's what this is about. Because really the bedroom in a relationship, it should be the best part, the one that brings in the light to a relationship. And that's all I'm trying to do. I'm trying to, I'm trying to give whoever wants a red deer an incredible, Man, what a place to stay. And that's all I'm trying to do. So come on in the master. Here's that other bathroom door. So that's this side, but the master, truthfully, the only thing that, well, I'll get smarter, is if my bed, if I were to hit a button and my bed would flip up, I allow you in this room, in which what I've come through this show to realize if it needed to be a work and stay place, meaning a person wanted to experience his income in here, 
this would be like going camping because you flip it up and you would look so forward to bringing it down but yet you're not confined because I'm trying to think through the process of tiny and catch all those niches and I just think that that's a that's a niche you have to feel you have to feel like it's home plain and simple so this is this is what we do this is my passion this is me so hopefully you've enjoyed a little bit of the walk through red deer and we look forward if there's a dream within you that we can maybe help you know come alive to my website uh, my and I have a phone number my number is 505-504-1873 or I have a just a I guess it's the the uh, mailing address whatever not too good on this is ray underscore renfro at yahoo.com red deer is working on its website but you know i look forward to hearing y'all